right, so the way that you want to tackle the first section of your specification sheet, um, it's, it's very similar to the way that we wrote the overview when we wrote the description in our job posting. The only difference in a spec sheet is that your overview is going to be a little bit more comprehensive. And if you remember in the job description, we had posted it pretty um, simply. We really only described it um, with two or three sentences. Here, it's okay to go a little bit farther with it. Um, but for the most part, you really just want to say the same thing um, and expand on it a little bit. Now, you can actually go back to your job posting and copy it in. Um, here, you can get away with posting a little bit more info. Uh, but for the most part, it's the same information, really. Um, here is where you would think to put something that... Not every single person needs to even read about, but someone who's doing a detailed estimation of your application, it, the information here is going to help them kind of wrap their head around what exactly they're estimating. It just makes it easier to process. Now, you can go without an overview section if you want to. I always suggest you do. You always want to make sure that your developer or whoever is looking at this um, is in line with your vision. So we just copy that in. Um, for this example, we're going to be using that that dating app um, that I just kind of made up. Um, if you guys want me to do other examples of creating specification sheets, I definitely can. It's a very important process for not only getting the right estimate, but not having problems later down the line because you left something out or you said something uh, in a way that was a little bit uh, iffy um, or had, didn't have concise language. In this section, really, again, we're answering the what, um, but I would try to expand a little bit farther. Generally, I want to say answer questions like, what does the app do? Uh, it's what, does, what is the app called? I would say things like, who uses the app? I would answer questions like, I would answer questions like, what, Ge geographical area is going to use the app. What is the key differentiator? Differentiator, and then even things like um, what are the most important features? So these are all questions that I would want to answer in the overview. Um, now, if your your overview you created for your job description is a little lacking, use these questions that I'm just asking right now to go back and add a little bit more to it. <laughs> ¶¶